Hi guys and welcome back to Divinity Original Sin 2. Yeah, let's see. We were going to explore this dungeon. Uh, something is wrong with my textures. Stuff here doesn't look right. Yeah, let's see. We wanted to go down. Ah, yeah, that's right. We wanted to go down here, but we don't know how to open this door. Doesn't break. Um, does our log say anything about this? What was it? Sheila's reward? No. Um, all in the family, yeah? From the Surrey Crypt. This is the Surrey Yes. Ah! This is the Surrey Crypt. Is it? I think that down here. <laughs> Let's see if we can lockpick this one. Somehow the textures are pretty weird. Like, ah, it's wet. Ah, it's the wet effect. I thought it was... Boss and tight. Oh. No chance to open that. This said something, but I don't know what it said anymore. Here lies Phil and Surrey, whose family's generous patronage helped build these burial grounds, and who refused to be buried in the Surrey crypt. So we can't go in there, we can't do that one. There was this hero's grave here is like pretty deadly. What is this? This is like a nice spot. Let's see what's up here. Biker's rest. Oh yeah, that's here on the map, yeah? this one I've seen it that stone garden it's here in this big house nice maybe we can go here directly but let's see what's up here this seems interesting nothing to pick up an ancestor tree. Even I can't deny the beauty. This is the ancestor tree? Okay. Looks pretty big. What's this red stuff down here? It's the roots. Some of you don't have swords, you don't have swords. We do something with this? The roots of a great ancestor tree reach from deep underground to the surface above and beyond. But this tree feels tainted. Reach into its spirit, searching for its memories. You are a scion of the elves. The mother tree demands your blood. You do not have a choice. She has a plan and you must serve her with your death. You heed your mother's wishes and take root. But okay. then you hear a voice. A friendly whisper from beyond. The voice knows you. He understands you. He loves you. He offers you your freedom and asks but one small service in return. Grateful, you accept. In an instant, you are an elf once more, walking in the world. But your new friend begins to make demands. Small services, then larger and more often. They cause you pain. At last, he bids you guard your tree. He expects you shall have guests. You shall kill the Godwoken when they come. Then you shall be free. Okay. Where is he? I can talk to guy you guys. The thought occurs. The sign replaced one bad deal with another. This is elven business, not mine. That story, it's a little too close to home. Poor luckless fool. As they say back in Mest. If you kill the cow for dinner, there's no milk for breakfast. Choices lead to consequences. No such thing as luck. 
Only self-earned success. Or as in this case, self-earned failure. Everyone's in charge of their own fate. Sounds to me like this incent has down the drain. To trade one soul for immortality and then lose out on your prize? That is unfortunate, no matter the circumstances. Okay, I thought there would pop up an enemy, but doesn't look like it. Oh, what's beyond here? This. Why can we see all of them? I haven't been here yet. Seems interesting. Ah, is this the oil pits where um, Red Prince wants to go? Maybe it is. <laughs> yeah, okay. Nothing there. <coughs> Sorry, guys. The weather has been pretty crazy. And I'm feeling it. So, let's see. No elven guy showed up. How can we turn this off? Is there something here to pick or something? Okay. Let's go this way. Let's go to Riker's Rest. What is this? Stone Guard. Maybe we should go there first. See if there's some clues to the... The dog growls and bears its teeth at you in a wide, unsettling grin. Oh. You swear you see a worm emerge from its grey-pink gums, then burrow back in. Okay. You talk the to The dog me. growls and bears its teeth at you in a wide uns- Come closer! I dare you! <laughs> Take a step ahead. You won't be intimidated by some mud. He sniffs. He snarls. <sighs> I am death. There's no defying me. Take another step, stand your ground. What or who is he guarding? Scoff at his arrogance, he's just a dog. Walk away, this is a confrontation you'd rather avoid. The dog's growls intensify and transform into a rhythmic rasp that mimics laughter. You swear you see the ground behind him momentarily churn and tremble. Hmm. Do not mock me. You know what lies beneath. But I will not allow you another step closer, human. Kana has already laid claim to it. Ask who Kana is. She calls herself master. I call her minion. Whatever name you choose, it is her hand that will wield it, not yours. Okay. The dog raises its head to the stormy sky and howls. The earth beneath you vibrates, a dirge plucked on the strings of a rotting lute. Necrotic troll, you are summoned. Crawl through the gate. The earth opens for thee. Uh, where is the troll? Is this the troll? No, oh, this is servant. Here is the troll. Caledon the Bone Crusher. Who is this guy? Long Buried Bowman. Andras. Level 11, level 11. This one is level 11. Uh, they don't hurt that much, at least until now. Um, use this on both of them. Oh, that doesn't do too much. Now use this. Nice. This did a lot more. Um, do swing at him. Nice. And hit him once more, you can't. Okay, so fortify... No, don't fortify. Oof. Fire? Do fire. Nice. Now you, you should move out of the way, maybe? Maybe not, maybe... And then... Engineal Bolt, Fireball, Supernova, Boat creating fire surfaces, dealing large area around you, except, except our obstacles. 
Electrical bolt, ricochet. Rallying cry, power infusion, enjoy. Incarnate, maybe an incarnate. Right there. But now you can give him more armor and more damage. You can shoot. Shoot at this guy. Nice hit. You hit him. And hit him again. You um, do this on him. Nice. That's what I thought. And he's gone, the summons are gone also. Intestines, high quality earth essence, fang. Chicken Claw Scroll, Cash Pitcher, and Unidentified Ring. War Master Tree. Okay, take it all. Let's see this ring identify. Warfare and summoning. Summoning is good for him. Aerotork, pyrokinetic. Yeah, maybe for him. Instead of this one. <coughs> what? Some skill requirement? Not met? Ah, okay. He is not having needed something for this. What was it that went away? Um, the skills. Skills is here. What went away? Anything bold? Uh, maybe this one. Arrow Turk 2. It's not so good. Um, I can take another one. This. This. Maybe for the price of this one. Ah, he has the fire slug also. Yeah, okay. And this is summoning. Oh, this is the summoning. On summoning on him. This. He gets the arrow to. Eh, whatever. It stays like this for now. So, it was a fine fight. Now let's keep on going. Eric Mushroom. Anything else? Where are we now? We are now at the Stone Gardens. What is this? Or This. Um, where are we going? Ah, this is the house of the other guy. Yeah? Yeah, this is Riker's rest. Within the Stone Garden's walls, peace be thy immortal fortune. Relieved of toil, free of indignity, until thou art called to serve. Uh -huh. Okay. Let's see, can we go in here? in here. Ah, here's a way out. Okay. It's sunny and stuff. Okay, so no way to get into there. Chicks, what is this? Seems important. Stairway. Let's go here. Let's see what this says. <coughs> Locked in perpetual prayer. Keep trying, buddy. Okay. A lot of crows on him. What's in here? Hey, there's a dead guy up there. Master Avon. Dead dwarf, dead dwarf, dead dwarf. A lot of dead dwarfs. 
In life, we are Earth's caretakers. In death, we are the skies. The eagle glowers at you with one baleful eye, keeping the other eye firmly trained on the stringy morsels of rotting flesh dangling from its beak. Hmm? Wow. Better for the eagle glowers at you balefully, with eyes like shiny little buttons. Pretty eyes! Eyes that see far! The eagle's own eyes glitter with avarice. I didn't tell the eagle to keep his claws far from your eyes. He wants to live. Distract him from your eyes by admiring his fancy ribbons. Wonder why he pecks at that crony corpse when there's better pickings around. Two eyes on the eagle, back away, take your leave. Peck, peck, peck. The eagle pecks free some choice lump of gristle from deep within the corpse. He swallows it whole, dark blood dripping from his beak and matting the fluffy feathers at his throat. Master died. Master told me what to do. All my life told me you are what you eat. So I do. I will become the master, unless you are not the new master, are you? Shake your head and bow low before him, ask if the new master is taking on apprentice. <laughs> Brush your boot into master's remains, tell him you are the new master, he must come with you. Tell him you are no master, but if he wants to eat lords, kings and even the gods themselves, he should come along and dine with you. Two eyes on the eagle, back away. Think me an owl? A wren? A crow? I am an eagle. I know my place in this world. He ostentatiously fluffs up his feathers and turns back to his sword. As long as we can loot everything. Why can't we loot the dwarfs? No? No? Okay. Weird. Such a big important place and we can't do anything there. Hm, maybe we could have gotten a companion here. But doesn't look like we still can. So let's go to this house. No, not this house. Um, this house. And see someone's home. Rikers, rests supposed to get over here maybe he knows how to get into the crypt there's a lot of masked servants here as you reach to push open the heavy door the coils and whirls of engraved wood dance into a new pattern the semblance of a face arises a face that seems to look right through you. A little Good. sorcerer, come to play. <clears throat> you are a sorcerer, are you not? Perhaps even God woken. Tell me true, now. Admit it, you are God woken, deny it, claim not to be God woken. Hold your arms, you think you can wear the door down with silent tendency. Hold your kick the door right in the teeth. If and say that you're a lone wolf looking for one of your own, is Riker home? Ignore the door and take your leave. Silence greets your answer. In the distance, you hear the screech of an eagle. Worryingly closer, you hear some kind of a moan. Time passes. At last, the lips on the door creak open and the door speaks. Enter. The face nice. melts back into the wood of the door and the whirls swirl back into a floral pattern. A loud metallic click can be heard from deep within. Okay. Let's save. <laughs> not worrisome at all. Only a madman would build a mansion on the edge of a graveyard. Oh, It's all to steal. Gold cup. Gold cup. Scarlet necklace. Riker's visit to a ledger. Hmm. Is this Riker? 
See you. This is Riker. Oh. Hmm. Where should I go? Maybe here? Masked servant. Ah, there's Riker. Here in the study. Okay. Level 14 trader. Truly beautiful poetry on the page. A visitor. Such a rare and exquisite pleasure. Hey. Okay. The elf tilts his head backwards, but his squinted eyes don't stray from yours. Call me Riker, and I shall call you Ifan, yes? Such fortune that a fellow lone wolf would cross my path purely by chance. Hmm. Marvel at his opulent graveyard mansion. Notice Mars 7. What? Who are they? Why, the stories are legendary, my good man. As you must have known of me from Lupine Tales, so do I know of you. Any lone wolf would recognize the Silver Claw on sight. To meet you is a great honor. Nice. I suspect you know yourself by yet another name, however. Godwoken. Not slowly, how did he know you were godwoken? Oh, Ifan, your reputation surely precedes you. Do you suppose you pass through this land unnoticed? I also see you are not yet whole. He presses a slender forefinger against his tight lips and hums. Hmm. I'm not a generous man, but I could give you what you seek if you offer something in return. A fair exchange between one wolf and another? Hmm. Ask what he wants from you. You must go to the Black Pits. There's a cavern there. In it, you'll find a stone tablet of considerable value. He points to the location on your map. Bring okay. it to me. Red Prince wanted to go to the Black Pits also. Dizziness. It lasts just a moment, but long enough for you to feel Ralik's presence. You hear no words, yet understand. It's imperative you accept Riker's bargain. Okay. The episode passes. Riker is peering at you intently. He awaits your reply. I would think that obvious, my good fellow. You're dying to show off those smoldering talents of yours. You just don't know how to handle them. I can help you with that. I can share my bond with the source with you. Fill your well to the brim. Make you a master. The rest of the story, well, it's yours to write. I wonder why he doesn't get him himself. Ask what this table does, tablet does. Promise it will be done. Tell Riker you'll take your chances, you don't want his help after all. It's a miracle of the ancients. Priceless, really, and powerful enough to draw the Magister's attention. Okay. I won't bore you with further detail. Suffice it to say, it is safer in my hands than in theirs. Hmm. It will be done. A promise you'd best fulfill. Riker bows his head deeply. Then you'll have the power you seek, if not the power that trumps it. There will always be one greater, you know. Now please, don't let me keep you. You met Riker. He teaches us if we help him first. Such dreamy prose. 
I could get lost. Last of our powers, Riker first sent us to a cave beneath the black pits. Find the cavern beneath the black pits. Who wanted to go to the black pits? With the face ripper, Fane will tear the faces from corpses and combine them with sword orbs to make a mask of the shapeshifter. Red Prince, waylaid by a but who sent him? Lizard Dreamer turns towards Driftwood. Hmm. I thought we had one to the Black Pits. Sawmill in the region. Truly beautiful. And the creator of that rock device, a lizard portal master named Hanag, may be somewhere in Paradise Dawn. Hmm. I was pretty sure someone wanted me to go to the. the Black Pits. Okay. But Black Pits it is, it seems. Okay then, let's go. I don't want to steal anything from him. Hmm. I still don't know how I get um, into that. Yes, I have. Where is it? In here? Yeah, in here. Does it go there? That's the way inside. Let's see. Hmm. Petrified. This doesn't good. What is this? Some kind of a sorcerer with a staff? Petrified Marauder, Petrified Pillager, okay, um, let's do a hard save, and let's do a small cut. So hope you guys enjoyed this part, hope you are back next time. And see you soon. Bye.